what's up guys if you're watching this then you know where we are we are in las vegas nevada las vegas baby sin city uh quick note this is being directed by a three-year-old son today is about finding things for him to do in las vegas so pretty much what we did was there's a ghost city pass right. that we got we actually got it through expedia we chose the three activity pass and it gives you a list of like 60 activities in the area and um, we narrowed it down to the three things that we think, that we hope. Yeah, we hope, because you never know what this kid. <laughs> but we hope that we hope enjoy. he's gonna like. So not everything we did was available through the GoPass. Some of the stuff we actually found through Google search. Mm -hmm. Well, he found through Google search. Yeah, I just pretty much searched things that I thought Nas would like. What we'll do is we'll list the activities that we found on the GoPass in the titles before we show them. Yeah. A lot of the activities three and up you have to pay for. So Nas is actually three years old, but today he's gonna be two and a half for the duration of today. Be two and a half so it works out. So this is twenty four hours in Vegas with a three year old. With a three year old. Let's go guys. <laughs> So this activity was one of our Google search results. We knew Nas loved excavators, so this was pretty much a no-brainer. For $21, he was able to operate excavator on his own for about 15 to 20 minutes, and he had a blast. Dig This is located 15 to 20 minutes away from the Las Vegas Strip. So whether you have a rental car or you want to take an Uber, it shouldn't be a hassle for you to get there. James, this is your little certificate. Shows you being here. And totally dug in here to dig this. But you've got a few more to go. You're a great operator today, but you've got a few more to go before you're an expert operator. Okay? Good job. There goes. This is another activity we found through Google search. A short five minute drive from our hotel. Nas really thinks he's a superhero, and for just $79, he was able to fly. We're here! Vegas Indoor Skydiving, the most unique attraction in Las Vegas. Vegas if you're having fun, show me a thumbs up. If you are not having fun and you want to stop, show me a thumbs down, and we'll take a time out and I'll ask you, hey, what's wrong? Whenever you're flying, I will be holding on to you and helping you out in there, okay? Who? Avengers. The Avengers? What about the Avengers? Are they closed? No, I think the Avengers are open. Okay. So let's go there. Let's go? Mm -hmm. You gotta brush your teeth first, bro. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Nas was beyond excited. We ended up arriving to Marvel Station before the employees could even get there.
to the Avengers Station, the scientific training and tactical intelligence operative network. My name is Maria Hill. This is your chance to be a part of something greater, an opportunity to help save the world. Let's see if you're up to the task. Not one detail was spared at Marvel Station. So whether you pay the full price or you book it via the City Go Pass, you won't be disappointed. Come. Look. Step on them, they're gonna go away. Step on it. Step on it. See? They gone. <laughs> Did you have fun, Pumpkin? No, that's a Hulk. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Did you have fun, Hulk? Yeah. Hulk's mouth. 